Here you can see some uh, follow-up. These are uh, one and a half year, six anteriors. This is a molar. This is a very interesting case that we will see because uh, this molar, there, there was a huge decay close to the bone crest. And this is the result after two years. These are two anterior, two central incisors with uh, vertical preparations for veneers. And this is the result. This is the follow-up after one year of these central incisors. This is a porcelain fused to metal with the, on this first premolar. This is a 10-year follow-up. After 10 years, I did this case in 2008. This is the follow-up of 2018. This is another interesting case. Uh, this was a tooth with scarf ferrule. I did the cast post, the classic one, and the zirconia after. And this is the 2.5 years control. I have also the 4 or 5 years control, and this case is always the same. This is my first full mouth rehab. I did, uh, if I'm right, in 2009 in zirconia. In this case, all the teeth have been covered with crowns. So we have uh, crowns from 6 to 6 in the upper arch and the same in the lower arch. Just we have some crowns on implants in the lower. But here is the result after one year. You can see the stability zero recession after one year. Here is the result after two years. Okay. You can see all the crowns in the upper arch. There is a good stability, even if the patient is not a great tooth brusher. And here is the result after 10 years. And I have also the follow-up of these cases of the last month. I did, you see, there are some fracture of the ceramic because this patient has parafunctions. He, is, uh, uh, he has bruxism. But you see that the stability of the soft tissues is very, very high. There is a very good stability of soft tissues even after 10 years.